Hi, I'm James. And I'm Emmy. And welcome to another episode of The Bestiary, Monster Manual A through Z. Today, we're looking at... The Ankeg. The Ankeg. What's an Ankeg? It is a big bug. A big bug. Try cockroach from hell. Huge chitinous shell, multiple limbs, horrifying pincery things, mandibles. Ugh. And all dripping from its large maw is just acid that it can spit at you from a distance. Yeah. Now, the acid actually is one thing that I like about this because for a low level creature, the Ankeg can present a decent challenge. Now, it gets the acid spray back on a recharge of six, so it's even less likely than, say, like a dragon's breath weapon. But for a low level character, 3d6 acid damage is kind of scary. Like, yeah, that can take you down in one. Absolutely. I know one of the other things that I love about its acid is the flavor of it. So when you read it, it's described that that's actually its digestive acid that's spitting up at you. It usually puts that on its food to make it easier to digest. And it really lends to that body horror aesthetic that absolutely just drips all over this critter. I know the other thing that I just adore about this that's really fun for low-level characters to discover strategy and what works best for them in a fighting situation is that this guy's armor class actually goes down if you knock it prone, which means that you're kind of discovering how to move around a monster, how to best manipulate it to your advantage. Yeah, it's, it's a good thing for a DM to throw at a low-level party, perhaps as a side quest or just a random encounter. Perhaps there's a farmer that says, Oh, there's some livestock going missing in my field. Might be some rustlers out there. And then you head out, and actually it turns out to be these terrifying, enormous bug things that are really quite scary. But then you find that, yeah, these things can be beaten. You can kill them. And I really love that, actually, the changing armor class, because I can't really think of very many other monsters where that is a thing, that you can change their AC. I also love that they burrow from under the ground, so they can come from anywhere, they can go anywhere. It's intimidating when, when you're a level 2 character and you're still learning who that person is and you really are excited and you don't want them to die. But the Ankeg might have something to say about that. Thank you for joining us this week on The Bestiary, Monster Manual A through Z. Do you have any fun bug bedtime stories? Tell us below in the comments, we'd sure love to hear about them. And if you enjoyed this video, please give us a like, it really helps us out. Go here to watch some more videos, and go here to subscribe to Adventurer's Pack. We'll see you next week when we talk about Azers. <laughs>